Naam, hatua ya serikali ukipa kituo kimoja cha habari huko nchini matangazo yote ya serikali imekosolewa vikali na miungano wa wanahabari huko nchini. Miungano hiyo ikiongozwa na Kenya Editors Guild imesema kwamba itaelekea mahakamani ili kupinga agizo wa mahatua hiyo ya serikali ikisema kwamba inanyima vyombo vya habari ruhusa ama kufanya matangazo ya kibiashara kupitia njia huru na basi serikali ilitangaza kwamba ingeweza kupeleka ama kuelekeza matangazo yake katika shirika la KBC na kudai kwamba ndio eneo ama ndio chombo pekee cha, cha habari ambacho basi kingeweza kupokea na kupeperusha matangazo yake ya kibiashara This causes immense outrage and concern among independent media outlets in Kenya. These directives are not merely misguided. They are blatant assault on the very foundations of a free and democratic society. They violate the principles of media freedom enshrined in the Kenyan constitution undermine free market principles and create a hostile environment for media investment. Recent similar action by the very same Professor Kisiangani is already <coughs> the subject of public interest litigation. KBC indeed needs help to grow strong and transform from a state broadcaster to the public broadcaster that the citizens of Kenya enshrined in their constitution. The first step to this is in freeing the hands and minds of the professionals at Broadcasting House to make independent, public-spirited determinations on how to apply its assets and deliver journalism.